Good morning, everybody. I'm Drew Meyer. I'm the director of our storage business. And you've probably heard of our ReadyNAS products, which have been highly successful. This is a Netgear Stora. It's a consumer device that we sell through retail channels. It's one terabyte with two drive bays in it. It becomes the center or the hub of all this fantastic stuff we're doing with connecting things. So for example, I have in my pocket an iPhone. It could be any handheld platform. It could be a, a BlackBerry, which is also very common. And I've got on here a wireless connection and a 3G connection. So anywhere that I am with my phone, my handheld in my pocket, I can connect to a network, either via cell tower or via a wireless connection. Then I can connect back home to my Stora and access my content. The Stora does three things really, really well. It's as easy as ABC, simple, access, backup, and centralize. So I can access with my phone, and not only me, but maybe some folks in here as well. Who's got a handheld platform that's close within reach? Great, and there's a, another one. There we go. Okay, there's, there's uh, information credentials written on there for a network. So go ahead, follow the instructions. If, if you have a, pl a platform that has a browser, you'll be able to do it. Yeah, anybody, that's fine. In the meantime, I'll show you what it looks like from this side. Oops, I got a switcher around. There we go. OK, can you see that all right? All right, that's my grandmother, Frances, on her 99th birthday. February of last year. So February 14th this year, she's gonna be how old? Yeah. So I can see her on my, I can see this picture on my cell phone or my handheld from wherever I am by just connecting it to the internet and then connecting to my store over the web. And it's not just about pictures access either. It's about other things. I can even connect with a browser from any platform to something like a movie, or a movie trailer in this case. So let's take a look at this Fast and Furious trailer, which you can see it's, it's jumping on the browser, and now it's gonna open up the player here on the iPhone and start running the video for us. So you get the idea, here's a screen. I can see content from any place, any time, on pretty much any screen, wherever I am. How's it going with you guys, getting any questions? All right, oh, hey look, got one up and running. So from a different browser, a different platform, a different, completely different network connection, he's accessing the same content or similar content as I am from that store. Not only with that, you can do it from other browser platforms as well. So I'm sure that'll come up in just a moment. Now let's take a look at what's going on. So I'm now on a PC with Explorer as a browser, and I'm connected to mystora.com. I'm just going to drop in and see what a store looks like on a PC browser. Again, I can do this on any connected platform. So if I'm traveling with my digital camera, I'm taking pictures in Hawaii on the beach, I go to the hotel room, I connect my camera to the PC in the hotel business center, connect to the web, connect it back home, dump my photos on there, and share them to my friends without ever having left the beach quite yet. It looks like a very different version of, you know, essentially this is NAS, but this is not your grandfather's NAS. It's a much more intuitive, exciting interface, and you can do things like, uh, really manipulate your photos much more powerfully than a traditional file and folder sort of interface. We've got a cool iris plugin that runs on this. So I can pull up my photos and check out the 3D video wall. Not nice? Pretty slick, huh? Can I get a woo-woo for the new year? All right. Yeah, there, there we go. So not just photos. I can do things like uh, play videos as well on this one. We, you just watched me do it on an iPhone. Here we can do another one, say Solomon Kane. Now, this is beyond just an access platform. We're actually using it as a media player. Again, this is from a browser, so this could be a Mac or a PC or a Linux machine or, as we showed earlier, a handheld. Uh, and it can pick up, you know, I was running this for the demo earlier, but it's streaming right now live, so you can see it catch up with the caching and start to run the movie. So, you know, if I'm sitting downstairs in my room, and my store is in a different part of the house, or whether I'm halfway around the globe, I can get access to this content the way I want it. Now, using the content that you have stored on there is one part of it, but the other really cool part of it is the sharing aspect, and one of the most powerful and exciting features. So I can do things like this. Create an album, share it out with everyone. It, the system will now email that to my friends if I select my friends, or I can even copy and paste this URL and put it somewhere else if I like. That will give specific people access to specific data, and again, they can do it from any screen, any place, any time, whatever browser they have. 
And the next cool way to share stuff is via social networking sites. You'll see here that I've connected the Stora, this album on the Stora, with Facebook. I've got my Facebook profile up here. When I drop something on my Stora, it synchronizes it with Facebook. There's the same picture of grandma that you saw on the iPhone that we looked at directly on the browser on the Stora. Now it's being shared via Facebook. All I have to do is put that photo in that directory. And finally, the same thing holds true with RSS. You see there is an RSS feed on this. Over here is a digital photo frame. It happens to have grandma right on it. My, my brother and I got her one for Christmas because she doesn't know how to do this and doesn't want anything to do with it. She's it's, 99 years old. That's right. She's 99. Almost 100. So she, she says, I don't buy any green bananas because I'm 100 years old. <laughs> She's got a great attitude. So the, the photo frame is at her house in Boise. The store is at my house in California. My brother lives in Seattle. He can drop his photos onto the store remotely, synchronize it, 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 put it in this directory, which is syndicated by RSS. The photo shows up on grandma's photo frame, and she's involved with our lives. So that's a pretty exciting way of managing and sharing this content using the network. And then finally, the most important screen of all, the one that I haven't even really talked about here yet, the television set. You have all this great stuff. You, you want to stream 1080p HD Blu-ray content. We have a DLNA certification for the Stora. So if your TV supports DLNA, or if not quite yet, you've got a game console, or better yet, one of our EVA systems, the EVA 9000 or the 2000 by Netgear, you can connect that to your home network. Now you're watching video content, mu music, movies, photos, and files right there on your television set from the, in the living room while your content is on your network. So bridging the gap between the TV and the, and the rest of the home network. So the store does three things really well. Access, backup, and centralize. It's as easy as ABC. That's it in a nutshell.